Hey guys, talking about Mazinandi Kano versus the federal government of Nigeria. Monday Ubani, human rights activist, he don't come again. You see, he don't tell Nigerian government about this Mazinandi Kano's case. He don't advise them, he don't beg them, but he don't understand what the government is up to. And the way they are handling Mazinandi Kano's case is no no to him. You understand he can also talk say the the best way to go about this uh i pop leaders case is political solution that the government should have applied solution uh, political solution you can't want president bola to know say see make you not go follow the footsteps of your presidential in this mazenam the tanus case so because by then we are digging you know what we cannot be able to carry you understand so the matter now be say why the government is still keeping mazinam the canal and why are they delaying his trial that is what you know he said he don't understand if you want try person you try him you understand not be say today you go get case then after three months oh they are just planning to keep him indefinitely in the in the cost study and this is not good look at the situation in the southeast you understand when he was asked what is your take on nam the canon's trial and the continued detention he said i have spoken on the issue of nam the canon several times and i've pleaded with the current president bola tunubu not to tour the uh, not to tow the line of the last president buhari in trying to put Namdi Kano in definite detention and all that. Even if they want to try him, the trial process must be hastened up to know whether he is culpable or not. But one thing I know is that the court of appeal that tried as to whether Kano has committed any offense for which he should be tried, the court said there is none, especially the legal way they brought him in and all that for whatever it is has actually nullified whatever they want to try him for. Now, having said that, I want Nam the Kanu to be granted bail. I also want Nam the Kanu to undertake to maintain the peace. There should be absolute peace. Release Mazi Nam the Kanu true political solution. We must begin to advocate for change in our federal structure. Nigeria is being run as a, a unitary uh, a system and that accounts for some of the problems that we are witnessing as a nation. Let the federating units be developing at their peace with states controlling whatever God has a, a, endowed them with. Then they pay interest, pay a great something to do the center. Let's run a physical federalism. We don't need to kill ourselves just to realize our expectations. Our agitation, not by fighting, my take is that Namdi Kano should be granted bill. And if there is any trial that wants to go on about Namdi Kano, they should expedite the process so that he can know his fate on time. The government can also say, look, why don't we use political solution to Nam the Kano issue and release him and he will go on the condition that there won't be any problem again, that everyone has learned their lessons. The country must recognize the fact that Nam the Kano is agitating for equality, is agitating for justice, for things to be done properly where the average Nigerian will be regarded and treated as a full citizen with the full equal rights, where everybody has equal rights and equity, not discriminatory. That is all. The same justice meted out to a northern should also be done for the Southeasterner, because God knows the reason he brought Nigeria together. Nigeria is a great country with great potentials, and we can maximize it to the benefit and joy of all. We must take economic measures that 
we make people that to make people happy, make people to be busy, make them to earn a living, give them good infrastructure, provide jobs, and you will see crime and insecurity giving way. Take care of those basic things that will make people commit crimes. Delaying the canoe's release is wrong, he said. Well, this is another person again talking about Mazin Namdekanu's uh, uh, continued detention in the DSS custody. I picked two things here. He said, "If you want to try him, why can't you, why why not hasten his trial, let him know me, let him know his fate? When I just say postpone, they postponed, and you are trying this person. The court, your court, have already said you have no case in any court in Nigeria. So what are you doing?" What are you doing? This is the reason why he said the other day, trying me, you are committing terrorism. You are a terrorist if you are trying me because there is no court in Nigeria that can try me. You understand? It is wrong. Nigerian government should apply political solution. Now, they don't they talk to this man, not they okay, not fine. He's sick. And you are still keeping him. Do you, do you even think about what of, God forbid, Say something can happen to Ram. The aftermath of that, will the government of this country be able to handle it? Because this person we are talking about has been discharged and acquitted. So why are you still keeping him? Why are you, why are you still keeping him? The thing is that the government do not want to hear whatever anybody is talking, but this is wrong. Uh, anybody, whether they hear person, whether it be government, it be individual, or you are organization or whatever, when people, about 10 people and more 15 persons don't tell you the same thing, this is the only way to go. And if you say now, nah, waiting five other persons talk, now nah, you go take. You go think, you know, the aftermath of what you are doing, what of if this thing happen, how will you handle it? So, Mazenam the Kanu's case is supposed to be, you know, handled with wisdom to avoid more calamities. Nigerian government knows that with what is going on now in the Southeast, Mazenam the Kanu be like key to the to the to the insecurity there. Once they release them, it go pull the key. And if it's the talk comes, everything go end. You understand? Well, when I don't hear waiting in talk, how now see I beg make me hear from you. Kindly drop your comment below the comment section. Thank you for stopping by.